Nick. You going crazy? I'm a real young legend, I'm one of the greatest. Ain't happen overnight, it's till I was a patient. Been grinding for years, I did no waiting. At this point, I'm on star, but they might well fade. They ain't gotta give me shit, I came in to take it. I'm a six figure nigga, little baby. I ain't basic, got a closet full of demons. I'm fighting with Satan when I'm out there, Waukesha. I move like the mage. I've been running up, baby, they been running their mouth. I done run up another catch. I'm you, you do the intro. You you know you got that intro type voice. Yeah, we back. We back at traps. <laughs> Don't do that shit, bro. Don't do that shit, All right, bro. We, we, we back at trap stories. Hey, why, hold on. Yeah. Why you sit with your chest poked <laughs> out? I know you work out and shit, but bro, you ain't got to sit. This is my chest, man. No, you like, bro, I'm not going to hunch. That's easy. You got bad habits. All right, come on. I'm ready. All right, trap stories. We're here with trap, obviously. The, the YouTuber now, man. The YouTuber. Mm -hmm. We're here with traps, fellow YouTube. Nah, I'm kidding. <laughs> Yeah, that's a fact. You gotta turn my boy up, man. Yeah, we're gonna turn him up. I got some questions for you, man. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. You feeling good? Yeah, out the gate. Out the gate. I love it, man. So, uh, you told me a little bit about your life, but I want to start at the beginning, though. I want to start in the early years in Durham. Uh, what was your upbringing like, man? <laughs> Shit, growing up in Durham, like, man, I got, uh, like, it's just, it's, it's, I don't even know how to describe it, like, but that shit different, though, like. Hey, the city, the city. That's right. what I tell people. The city, just the city. Y'all say that. Like, uh, it's, like, it's, it's like, it's like anywhere else, you feel me? Like, you feel me? Everybody know what's going on in the streets. Like, mm -hmm. it's, it's darn, like, everybody hear about darn, like. That's a fact. You feel me? Growing up, you feel me? Around everything, drugs, guns, whatever, like. Yeah. This shit, this shit is reckless, like. This shit get real, like. Real dirty, like. So talk, dirty. talk to me when it comes to guns and drugs. Like, is that was that normal? Was it cool? Was it like like how was it as a kid? Like, how did you view that stuff? Was it just like, oh yeah, that's that's going on, whatever? Or is it like, oh, I'm, I'm gonna get into that when I get older? Like, what was you what was you thinking? Mm, that was what I was thinking like that shit was just normal, like. Yeah, that's a fact, that's bro. Like, I had my first gun shit. when I was five, bro. That's really? a fact. My uncle, really? my uncle gave me a twenty-two rifle, no cap. I was five, bro. That's not like, nobody never asked me no question like that, so oh, I ain't even never like you feel me like saying that like I don't know like. Well, I'm here to ask the tough questions, me. man. Let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> oh, gotcha. God. So I mean, did you grow up in like a in a neighborhood that if you were to say people from Durham would know? Yeah, yeah. I get it. That's a fact, bro. <laughs> Hey, don't play with our talk like that, no. I grew up all around there, but my hood, like where I grew up in, like when I was jumping off the porch for real, yeah. Reservoir Street, the back end, like Reservoir Street. Okay, yeah. okay. So, what were some of the challenges growing up on Reservoir Street? Shit, trying to get some money. Yeah. Hey, it be but used to boom one though, bro. That shit, man, that shit, no, that shit, I love that shit. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. I love that shit with a passion. What specifically, just getting money? Just, just my hood, like, fuck getting money, but that's a part of it too, but I just love that's being back there, like. That's a fact. That's just, when, even when everything just coming, like, everything in the block, but that shit is really like a movie, like, mm -hmm. if anybody come out of that cousin and, like, and it's really up there, man, you ain't gonna want to leave. I ain't gonna wanna leave. I know he used to be scared you. to come up there, bro. Anytime I used to tell him to pull up up there, he's all bring his gun, man, bro. I'm, I'm my mama care. <laughs> Niggas been calling me like, I'm finna come out there like, goddamn shit, this this me, like, I'm in this right here, like, That's goddamn, I'm good. I'm just trying to goddamn my people out there, like, you feel me? You like, making excuses trying to come out right, there. Right, he, like, he don't want nothing to happen to him. Like, he wanna make sure everything good. Like, he, you feel me, like, he he hearing like feel like shit, certain shit be happening or like motherfuckers just be trying to be on point, but they cautious. You feel me? Like yeah, like tighten up. Growing up on Reservoir Street, right? You love it. It's home to you, right? When did you first start? In, when did you first start getting some money, man? Like like, and, and and what what was that for you? Like what what were you doing? You know. When I first started getting some money, I was like, I ain't gonna put it. I probably was like, when I first started getting some real money, 
I was like 19, like, okay. Like when I started really like, like saving my money, got them and, and doing what I really want to do. Um, that shit is right. If you we just taught me a lot, like, and then seeing everybody around me, like, what they said, like, that's a that's fact. motivation, like, that shit, you, you got to, you got to get this shit. Hey, no, I'm telling you, if you go up there, you gonna get some money too, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think so. Tell me, bro. Yeah, what do you think I, what, what should I do on Reservoir Street to get some money? I don't know, you what's figure most, that out, but What's most common on Reservoir Street? You figure that out. I'm not man. saying y'all doing nothing, but what's going on on Reservoir I'm Street? I'm saying you figure that out, bro. <laughs> you pick your, your poison, bro, but okay. you see other people sell, get money, you gonna wanna get it. I can go sell life insurance on Reservoir Street? Yeah, that's a fact. A lot of people ain't got life insurance. That's, it's, it's a problem. <laughs> 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 we all gonna die. Why you ain't gonna get paid? I'm not yeah. talking about life insurance all the time. Hey, you know what's crazy? I'm gonna put people up on game about life insurance. A lot of people don't know this. Do you know you know how people kill people with life insurance policies? Yeah. Like when well, they be having a million, two million. Mm -hmm. Do you know you got a two million dollars or a million, but you can borrow money out of that? Yeah. Infinite a lot of banking. people don't know that, but people be killing their wives and husbands for their insurance when they can just go borrow half of that money. That shit crazy. Yeah. I'm about to start one policy right now for life insurance. I was thinking about All right, so I know you talked to me, you said uh You've been locked up a couple of times, man. What what experiences led to you getting locked up the first time, man? What happened? What happened, man? Hitting licks. Hitting licks. I remember Cud got locked up. He was young as hell. Yeah. I remember that shit, too. I remember one day I seen him next time. I'm like, damn, what the fuck Cud is in? They're like, boy, he locked up. I'm like, man, I ain't no way I just seen him, bro. There's no way he locked up. Was it worth it? Was it worth it for that lick that you hit? Mm -mm. You ain't get nothing out of that? Yeah, no. When that shit be worth it, like when you win it, be like contemplate, like, yeah, I'm locked up. Everybody out there, like, if you all, when you get locked up, you always feel like you can do way better. That's a fact. That's like, a fact. I'm telling as soon as you know you about to get locked up, everything you did done about to pop in your head. Mm -hmm. Like everything. Everything. You did. <laughs> What's the hardest part about being locked up? Shit, being away from your folks, away from the family. Yep. Okay. Then you can't get no money in that bitch. Like, it, it, it depends where you at, though, you feel me? Mm -hmm. Like, so, yeah, you stopping the ground, you stopping the bad. Where were you at the first time? Uh, I was in Durham County. Durham County? I'd have been in prison, too, though. Like, okay. Yeah, yeah. Well, I'm glad. I'm glad I ain't gonna touch that yard, man. Yeah, yeah. So okay, you've been to jail and you've been to prison. I heard you were in Durham County Jail. Like what's what's like the major difference between jail and prison? Because I don't know. The freedom. The freedom. And, and the, like the food, all that, like just the whole thing, like it's way different, like. Right? It's real, but you like it's like prison is a, that shit is a whole nother world too. Like mm -hmm. that shit ain't that shit on a whole nother type time for real. Like, is it just because people are in there and they're uh, more people are, are in there for life and longer sentences and yeah, stuff, and they're yeah, just they're thing. they're hungered down, ready to be in there for, yeah. for life? Yeah. So with jail, I mean, with Durham County Jail, was was everybody in one room? Did you guys have like certain cells? Like, how did that even work that out? Shit, one by one cell, one by, one man, one man. One yeah, sentence. but how did you, you have, have roommates sometimes? You feel me? Yeah. The walls be closed yeah. in, boy. How did you have more freedom at, at Durham County Jail? No, uh, Durham, not Durham County, the prison yard. You have more freedom at the prison. Yeah, that's a fact. Oh, I that's see. A fact. I yeah. see. Interesting. I thought it would be the other way around. Nah, no, people be ready to get out their county. Yeah, you don't yeah. want to sit in their county, boy. Yeah, you ready to go to prison? It get right? it's full of grown people. Them motherfucking nasty as hell. Yeah, like, bro. Yeah, yeah. So you think it's it's nastier people in the jail yeah, than the prison? Yeah, in prison it's a cold. Like it's a cold. Like you got to be clean. Like you got to because people there they they been they go be that's their home. Yeah, like, yeah. So you got to move a certain type of way. Like you feel me? Like you got to. Yeah. Wow. Uh, yeah, so like out here, you got to know how to move. Like mm -hmm. you got to know how to move. That's hey, that's one thing Durham teach you how to move, bro. That's I just crap. told somebody that I say, bro, Durham right. will teach you how to move. Right? Don't let them niggas come down here from somewhere and move to Durham. And two, three years later, boy, they think they got them, got so much game now. Like niggas be 
Oh, oh this smart, this <laughs> So Durham teaches you how to move and be safe. So give me like a red flag that you learn like in Durham. So like what's something that you see and you're like, oh, something's about to happen. Like, like what do you what do you notice? Is it because I know every time I'm with you and it's like hey, we're doing a music video, it, it could be an old lady driving a car, but every time a car comes by, you like, hold up, bro. I was just saying, bro. I'm time. thinking about now, but shit, I man. I just like to be safe, bro. Got them tinted windows. Mm -hmm. Got them how they be sound, how they be look. Mm -hmm. With ear it is. I'm, I, it's shit crazy. Oh, bro, what? I just said yesterday, because I was sitting at the gas store. Bag in and the dude pulled up, he just kept looking. I'm like, damn, I am in my little my little get-around car. I'm like, and my tent black. I'm like, he definitely thinks it's young niggas in here. Yeah. I can just see how he was staring at the car. Mm hmm And so he was just looking out for it. He wasn't trying to like attack you or nothing, right? Nah, he was just looking out. Yeah. I be chilling, bro. Yeah, you be chilling. You just got no shit. We safe. You know what I'm saying? Gotta stay safe in the city. Hey, something else that kept my attention. Like, if I get on the highway and I get off on the exit and you keep making them turns I make. What? Oh, yeah. You tripping. Play with me. You tripping, man. I ain't kind of made some shit in there. Like, oh, swear. Give me an example. What are you talking about? I done been chased before. Yeah? Like, somebody chasing me. I swear to God, they in the Maserati. Yeah. Just out of the blue? Yeah, like, like you just not, driving and chasing. I seen them, but I'm not paying attention because it's a Maserati. Yeah, like trying to got them do me. Like photo, bro. Photo, silver on my souls. Mm. All right, no cats some crazy. Like what? So like, how far did that go? Like, were you guys like you you had to speed and you got away from them? Like, how did that work out? Did they? Shit, I got no, I got away, got them, but I crashed the wheel. I hopped out on feet. Oh wow! Yeah. Wow. I can't yeah. imagine just getting chased out of nowhere and then I crash and I gotta hop out and run. That's crazy. Oh God. Shit, real. Wow. So talk to me, cause I know you've been you've been shot a lot. Shot a lot of times, separate times, a lot at one time. Like it's unimaginable. Uh share what you wanna share, but but walk me through like what, what happened and, and how are you like still alive, man? Like what, what happened with that situation? Shit, goddamn. Shit, I'm you know, on the back end of my hood. I'm in, in my hood and shit late night, you feel me? Okay. I ain't even trying to go out there right now because I ain't even got there. I ain't struck. Like, I'm, I'm on some whole other shit. I just left the studio like, no cap. Mm -hmm. But the nigga I'm with, shit so crazy. And the city, his little brother just got killed. So he don't even want to drop me off nowhere. Yeah, he know I'm not safe here, you feel me? Yeah. So he dropped me off in the hood, you feel me? He dropped me off in the hood, got me He dropped me off in the hood. So I'm at my I'm at my people's crib out there, you feel me? Just like the little hood spot. You feel me? Somebody stay, everybody can come in to everybody cool, you feel me? Mm. So got now. I mean, I'm in there chilling and shit. The the people who house it is, you feel me? That's my people, like she got a daughter and shit. A daughter like around my age and shit, you feel me? Love. Little hood, little boogie, you feel me? Everybody fuck with, she fuck with anybody, like, mm -hmm. you feel me? Okay, like, yeah, okay. Like, God damn, shit. So you're in this house, you're in your people's house, a lot of people are friendly with these guys, uh, with, these, with this group of people, so like, what happens then? You're in the house, right? Yeah, I'm in the house, I'm in the house, you feel me? See, long story short, you feel me? She got some niggas pulling up, you feel me? Uh-huh. Got them come drop a car, she let niggas hold a car, and she like that, one of them types, so. Yeah. Nah, yeah. So, so niggas pull up. I know them. I done, I done been seeing them. You feel me? I done been seeing them come over there. They, I ain't got no smoke with them. You feel me? I know them. Like, yeah, you know, I know niggas. Like, but niggas ain't niggas ain't cool. But I know niggas. So you feel me? Everybody, everybody know everybody in the city. Yeah. So got them. You feel me? I'm got now. I'm coming out the porch. I'm coming out the porch. You feel me? I got my blitz showing though. Yeah. I got my blitz showing. I ain't even had no blitz at the time. My homie, you feel me? He had blitz, so got no. Yeah, I got, I hold his blitz. I'm about to go, you feel me, to the cigarette lady house and shit. I'm gonna go to the cigarette lady house and give me some cigarettes and shit. So got, I'm coming out, I'm coming out the porch. They in the car, they in the car, but it's a nigga on the side of the, of, the, of another car. He pin, but I don't know that. I'm trying to see who he is. Yeah. So I don't know who he is. I'm like, who that? You feel me? He like, who that? So I'm like, got now. So he say his name. So I said, so I say my name. He asked me who, who I am, you feel me? 
So I say my name. I say I say my name. I say yo, this is my baby. Like yeah, you feel me? Out the gate. Like what we doing? Like you feel me? So got the. Um, I walk off. I walk off. I walk off. You feel me? I walk to the seat right there. Well, I'm not even on the. I'm just trying to see who he is for real. Yeah. Like. Because a lot of shit be going on up there, so you got to be on point. So I'm got to try to see who he is. I don't know what they was. I don't know if he took it offended or got down your feed me or got down or niggas was already on some bullshit. Like, yeah, you feel me? But got down, long story short, I'm walking back. I'm, wa- I'm walking back. And niggas hop out the wheel. You feel me? Out the gate. They trying to, out the gate, trying to bang out the gate. So got down. I'm trying to, yeah, at the same time, like, so we got um, So wait, they drove up on you? No, they nah, didn't see it. So they walked yeah. up on you. I walked up. back to the house. They at the house that I was at. They in the drive. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I'm walking back to the house. You feel me? Mm-hmm. So somebody hop out the wheel. He hop out the wheel trying to line me up. So I already got my. I'm trying to line him up too. Yeah. You feel me? So he go down. Like. So every, everybody draws and the shit just starts happening. Yeah. Everybody's. So it's crazy because it seems like you didn't have any ill intention. Right, you were just being observant, like, hey, who are you? Mm-hmm. Right. And then he's like, Who are you? Right. So it sounds like it was just like a, a communication thing. Either that or they had some shit going on mentally mm-hmm. where it was like, Oh, you he thinks he can talk to us, you know, well wait till he comes back or something. Yeah. That's crazy. No 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 history, no no insults, no aggression. You just come back and you just start getting shot. Bro, misunderstandings, bro. I tell you, yeah. misunderstandings be the cause of a lot of problems for some reason. Bro. Like, because yeah. you don't never know what the motherfucker on, so yeah. you got to be ready, like. But I'm also assuming be... you can't be so friendly because then you seem weak, maybe. Yeah. You're like, well, like, hey, how are you, sir? Who who are you? Excuse me? Like, you know, you seem <laughs> weak. You seem like, you know. So it's like you got to kind of, you got to keep the facade up. You got to seem cool. Like, hey, who, who are you? Like, like, like who that? Like. But it's still, it's fat, bro. Uh, that's, that's crazy. You got to be like, that's just how it is. When you go to the store, like, you see somebody like, say y'all both got on masks. Yeah. Like, you on point. Like, you, you got no, I'm gripping too. Like, yeah, the game. Yeah. 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 too. Yeah. Like, who is you? Like, what you on? Like, where you from? And in a different situation, y'all probably could have been friends too, right? Yeah, but some too. stupid shit happened. Hey, bro, it's crazy city, right? I told him one blood. And he was beefing with somebody, right? Yeah. And I'm like, bro, y'all got cool. Y'all probably make more money than y'all ever made. Yeah. Yep. But I'm telling you, like a year or two later, they got cool. He like, bro, you were right, bro. He like, bro, I mean, I like a hundred bands fucking with, bro. Yeah. I'm like, bro, that's how it be sometimes, bro. Y'all be similar. You just so happen to be from two different sections, bro. Mm-hmm. Like, niggas be having the same intentions, bro. That's how that shit be. Imagine mm-hmm. if everybody if everybody just band together, everybody start making money together. That yeah, shit be hard, right. bro. <laughs> that would be... T- that's be not me to be for real, but it's it, trust. Yeah. Some, some shit always still go spark, though. Yeah, like, niggas be hating. Mm-hmm. You feel me? Like, mm-hmm. I don't care. That's what I feel. I feel like niggas was hating. Like, yeah, that's a fact. Like, so, look, check this out, right? Bro, we like, I ain't never, like, by the grace of God, I ain't never felt that far. Like, bro, when you first got hit, like, what was you feeling like, bro? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, man, I can't really feel that. I ain't even got love. So, it didn't feel like anything. It don't feel like I'm anything. You just part. feel like, like, after a while, I just feel like you draining, like you fainting. Oh, that's like your, Like, your body just, like, you going. Like, you just, yeah, that shit is a crazy feeling. It's a, it's a, it's a, I'm feeling like, bro. And so, okay, if you don't mind going back to that story, everything goes down. I'm assuming eventually everything stops. And so, like, what are you like? Are you injured somewhere? Do you, do you like call it for the ambulance? Like, how, mm-hmm. how did you, how did you recover from that? You feel me? So, goddamn, I didn't got hit. I didn't drop my, drop my gun and shit. So, goddamn. I make it back in the crib and shit. I make it back in the crib. I'm still hit, but I don't even know how many times I'm hit for real. Yeah. I just I got shot in my finger to my finger like so fucked up, like hanging to the point like. Oh man. I just see my finger like what the hell like man. I would have find it. But man, I'm just talking. I'm talking to my niggas and shit. My niggas was in the house too. My niggas in the house like they say got no. When I walked off, got no. They was woofing and shit like got them da da da. Like when he come back, like, you feel me? They ain't got no bleak. I'm the only one with bleak. Yeah. So goddamn, what they gonna do? Yeah, that's a fact. Like, what they gonna do? You feel me? So goddamn, they, so goddamn shit. So I come back. It go, it go up like that. Straight like that. Yeah, like this and that. 
So got them. I'm shot. I'm making it in the house. See me as I'm getting shot. As I got, I didn't feel like two, three times. Like yeah, boom, falling so hard, getting up though, yeah. so fast, man. boom, like getting up, right on game, like no cap. So boom, I got to make it in the crib. I'm bleeding and shit. I go to the bathtub. I, I try. To, I take all my clothes off. Hop in the bathtub and shit. Get all that blood off me and shit. You feel me? Yeah. I'm got down. I'm so high to it. At the moment, so I'm just. I'm trying, I'm just cool. I'm really just cool and like trying to stay goddamn. Trying to stay awake, I guess. Yeah, uh, trying to stay, stay up. Like, yeah. Like trying to got stay afloat. So goddamn, um, yeah, so goddamn, I get all the blood off of me. I got, I'm trying to get some water shit. You, you get real dehydrated too, you get shot. Hmm. So I'm trying to get some water. But water so good, like, I'm like, oh my God, like, boy. I'm like, well, I'm about to go. Like, yeah, no cap. I'm telling them, like, boy, I'm like, I can feel it. Like, no cap, but shit, grace to God, I'm still here. Yeah. So, still, still, still. so, I mean, how did you, <laughs> you dance or not? Yeah. Okay, so, like, after going through that experience, do you do you find, like, a new appreciation for life? Yeah, 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 I do. <laughs> <laughs> You're laughing at life. Yeah, yeah. Life is precious, bro. Yeah, yeah, life, life is, is precious. precious. But, like going through some shit like that, cause that shit will change you, bro. Like they tell you that they put you on their fit and all and that. So I ain't no telling them what else they putting on, putting in. Yeah. Right. And them trying to make you, uh, trying to make you stay alive. Like, yeah, that's a fact. Yeah, yeah. That shit, that shit yeah. cost a lot. Like, yeah, yeah. No cap. Like, I'm in that bitch. I heard. <laughs> <laughs> five months a long time. Yeah, five yeah. months. Imagine, I'm, and, I'm, and I'm not even moving. Like, <laughs> not, I'm banished up, like, real deal. Like, so you're probably just in there, you know, whatever, gaining weight, just sitting there for five months straight. Just, yeah. wow. How did your, um, yeah. how did how did your community help you with the hospital? Did anyone come see you? Like, how was that? Yeah, my, my folks came to see me. That's good. I don't want to say community. Community? <laughs> community. That's a big word, right? You like that? Yeah. So, yeah. Why are you looking at me for me? Because my next questions don't really flow in. Flow. I'm so high. Uh, mm -hmm. What you mean? What, what's your next question? And the next question was, uh, Many people might, so I, I didn't write this. I had AI write this. Hey, AI, I'm going for Yes, I've been using AI for everything. Yeah, you should have never sent me this on the website, boy. <laughs> it's, I, I wrote, uh, me, oh, it wrote, many people might struggle to understand the choices you made. What factors influence your decision? I'm saying they could kind of fit in there depending on how you say it because yeah. you could be like, my favorite, like, couple, like, what's one of the worst decisions you feel like you ever made? Like, what's the bad, like, a bad choice you made? And at that moment, you knew, like, damn, I should have did this. And you getting shot. Right there. That's a fact. But what, what? Me but that going wasn't your choice, though, Me right? going where I was going. Mm, that's a fact. You probably said, really, like, damn, these cigarettes. But as I told you, the dude, he didn't even want to drop me off nowhere. But I, I feel I should need with his crib then. That's it, a fact. Right? Were you on Reservoir Street when this happened? Was it yeah. somewhere? Yeah. I was wow. on Reservoir Street. But that's where you were living, too. Yeah, well, nobody out there. Was well, nobody out there at that time of night? Like everybody mm -hmm. was gone. That's a fact. Mm -hmm. I would That's everybody a fact. leave. My folks be out there so long. It's time to go home. Some people stay out there. Some don't. Mm -hmm. You feel me? Yeah. Like, it's it's different different days. Yeah. Like, do you still do you still find yourself around there sometimes around Reservoir Street? Yeah, I ain't going nowhere. So if you could say um, that street in particular, how, how many times is that? Is some shit going down? Like shooting is there anything else? Like is this, is this like a weekly thing? It's it's so much. Did it get better? It's, it's so much stuff that was going on around that time. Like a lot of shit was going on, but don't nobody be out there no more because shit, a lot of shit that happened. So niggas cooling right now. Like yeah, niggas trying to stay out the way. Like like you feel me? Niggas trying to stay out the way. Bro, it looks so different out there now. It's so many Mexicans out there. I be going out there. Right, that shit make me mad for real. 
Really? Like, right. And bro, I'm gonna tell you, oh, buddy did it on purpose though. He raised the rent on all the cribs. Like, bro, I was up there trying to get a crib. He told me like eighteen hundred. I'm like, eighteen hundred for an area like that? Yeah, I'm like, bro, bro. come on, bro. I'm gonna yeah, he, be like, turned, he turned those cribs into like halfway houses for rapists. But it's bro. When I be over there in my people crib, you know how they see the alerts? Hey, yeah, the rapists be popping up on my junk. Bro. Yeah, I, I look. Alert. I seen. I didn't look rapists up and shit on my phone. And all of them right down reservoir. Bro, it's a lot of them. It's a lot of them. It's a lot That's of them. Somewhere you want Ladies to too. Wow, really? Yeah. Wow. On my son, bro, they got they got they got child molesting like charges like that. It'd be a lot of different ways, like, but that's shit all the same. Mm-hmm. That's a fact. Mm-hmm. Like, yeah. So when you were in prison, I know I know people who do crimes uh, when it comes to like sex crimes and stuff are really 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 looked down upon like it's not respected at all did you mm-hmm. see, did, did you see or experience someone finding out that another inmate had those crimes yeah, yeah, yeah. and so okay so what happened with that did, did anything happen like did they he can't he can't live around this like he can't he can't be in here that's a fact he gonna check off he gotta go somewhere else if he don't just check off or like what's check off that mean leave the pie. Yeah. Leave wherever you should, when they tell you to go to sleep at. Yeah. Like, you feel me? He got to get out of there. There you go. Die. But I'm, I'm about to say, I don't, did he have anywhere to go? I mean, because I yeah, mean. Yeah, there's a lot of places to go there. Oh, okay. <laughs> so you can just transfer around in prison. You can just transfer you can't to a different transfer stuff. around unless you check off or they send you somewhere. Oh, okay. You feel me? But I imagine if you ain't got nowhere to go, you kind of fucked, right? They, gonna, they probably going to hurt you or kill you, right? At that point. We're gonna put yeah. you in there and see what happens. Nah, I'm good. I'm good. I'm clean. I'm, I'll shoot a video in there and we'll be all right. Do a little prison YouTube. Be all right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's crazy because, bro. What would you know? My you brother shot a video for. Um, you ain't got that charge. You good, though. Nah. All right. Bro, I got from it. Mr. Salem, bro. Who? He got the witch. Mr. Salem. I don't know. Light scared. He was beefing with stomach. Okay. Couldn't play mod. My oh. brother, you didn't see that video he dropped while he was in the fed? No. My brother shot at him. They were selling me. Oh, in the prison? Yeah, the with, fans with a be, phone or something? Bro, or with a fans, camera? The fans be lit. Bro, it's crazy because my brother can get money in prison, but on the streets, he can't get no type of money, bro. But, bro, while he in the feds right now, he paying his girl rent, his son and mama bill. That's insane. Now, I'm going to keep it a band with you. Man, he be paying my car payment, man. <laughs> I'm gonna keep it a man with you, bro. Well, so why is that? Is it because like certain like contraband is just more expensive, so you can sell it for bro, more? Some niggas just know how to hustle in the streets, and then some niggas not hustling in prison. But like, what does that look like? Hustling in the prison? You just you just bring it. You just. I'm saying it's kind of like the it's streets. You just in prison. It's like you got, bro. You, I know people they got peas like pounds of weed in prison. Bro. Yeah. But don't they do shakedowns and shit? How do you hide a whole town? They got a prison on lock. They got this shit in yeah. control. Bro. That's a fact. So some prisons they get just run it, bro. They got to like it's in the feds. The 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 police check in with a with different like race. They check in with goddamn like oh really like head persons That's in charge of each race or or what you reckon or all that like. So it's like almost like free game. It's like you got the mob. Peace, you got the mob. The cartel in the feds. The shit like. Real moths is like they living good. Like in that bitch. Yeah, they gonna get you gone. Wow. Well, like they getting shit gone then motherfuckers dying there. So it's just like the streets, they gotta tap in, mm-hmm. like you gotta be got no you gotta be solid, like you gotta be Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of shit going on. They fight cases, all this. So. And so going back to you having more freedom in prison, you know, they're not just in a cell all day. They're walking around, they're yeah. going to the yard. So I yeah, assume yeah, well, there's school in there, there's library. Yeah, the you got church in there too, don't you? Sometimes church. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's a lot of shit going on, man. Wow, bro, what what my nephew at? They be bringing him Chick Fil A and shit. Yeah, they do. I be like, like bro, he better than I ain't <laughs> name my boy. <laughs> How that's insane. That's insane. Bro, people got the wrong outlook of prison based on TV, bro. Yeah. There's a lot of business going yeah. on in prison too, like little shit that you have to pay for. That they got from the street, there's people coming okay. to prison. Like, they don't really tell you about that part, but it's a lot of shit you can do there. Like, you can get some shit done. Like, it's, they got school and shit, people that bring different food and all that type of shit. Like, what's like, what's, what's something that you saw in prison that 
you didn't expect to see or surprised you or anything like that? Yeah, it was crazy like I got uh, surprised to see. <laughs> I don't know, like, okay, okay. See, just being there like damn, I done got no made it here. So you were <laughs> <laughs> So you were surprised, you're like, damn, yeah, I'm like, really in prison. Yeah, bro, yeah. Don't, nobody never think they gonna go, bro. Right. Like, you know what we thinking, like you get locked up, you ain't thinking like damn I'm about to go to prison. Yeah, yeah, like we ain't really seen you out there. I ain't got no seen your ass out there in the bus or a little van or some shit. Like, yeah. you get there and see that shit, that shit like a castle or some shit. Like, some real crazy shit. Like, damn, boy, and I'm all the way. I'm from Durham. Like, well, they got me all the way somewhere I never even heard of before. Yeah. That's a fact. And how, how long were you in prison when you were there? Shit, my first time, I did two years in prison. And I was keep going back for parole and shit. <laughs> two years. Wow. Yeah. I heard, man, no, you gotta listen to his music, bro. I think he hard, but he be bullshit, you know, bro. Like, it's hard, bro. Like, mm. I ain't gonna count, man. Y'all might be like a good cop, bro. Shit, you know, mm. like, bro, you might. Be, I was telling him, I think, like, dude, people like, make a whole living on YouTube hard. talking about prison like, and, and bro, just that by itself. Hard, bro. Like, yeah. And that's why I was telling him, I'm like, bro, like, do the podcast. Do the, bro, like, once people hear the story, Bro, a lot of times people don't even deal with rappers off their music. They deal with them off the store. Mm -hmm. They come with them, bro. Yeah. yeah. Like, I do that. I ain't even know I be looking at. I be looking at a lot of shit. And kept, bro, right. Some rappers, I don't even like their music. I just deal with them because of them. Mm -hmm. Like, I don't even listen to their music. That's a lot of shit ain't, be, no, ain't going on. So that shit be, it be, it be boosting the music. Like, yeah. yeah. Especially. If we can rock the man, no, wait, bro. This is shit. I fuck with it. Okay, I I'm gonna listen to all the way home. I got you. I got you. So, okay, with with music, then, like, when, when did that all start? Like, did that was that always a passion? You always growing mm -hmm. up, like, man. I, I, I yeah, I always like growing up. I wanted to play baseball and shit. You feel me? Like, yeah, that's what I used to play and shit. Like growing up, and shit. When I was in middle school and stuff like that. But they ain't work. I saw like I was supposed to. I was like, they ain't work. I'm, I'm a rap. Like I got to get rich one way. Like, like and I like doing it. So, so yeah, I start. I start rapping with like when I really first started getting some money from it. Like, like and I just, I just kept doing. It. I, I just, I just like making music to it. Like I didn't just also put it out that shit. Like. On some therapeutic shit, like just, it's just, a fan. just making music, bro. Like, I really feel like I can do this shit all day, every day. Mm -hmm. Like, I really feel like that. Like, if and I'm got them having that shit too, like, what? That's a fact. Like, it's fuck, uh, But that's why I stopped rapping, bro. I feel out of love with it. Yeah. Well, a lot of people be saying that too. I feel out of love with that shit, bro. Uh, that's just what happens when you're not in the, in the, in the booth. Like, you gotta be there to get that feeling. Like, I ain't been in the studio about like, yo, bro. Like, uh, you gotta be there. I'm like, fuck me, I'm on like, YouTube, bro. <laughs> I yeah. can sit in the crib, record, and I'm on like, YouTube, bro. We need to do some, uh, this is cool. We need to do some some different types of videos, though. Like, I feel like. Uh, bro, you be trying to get me to do some shit. I feel like you're right. I ain't even say not one word. Because I know you, you cut me going, off. Going, bro. Like, some I entertaining know. shit, bro. So. so I ain't mm -hmm. got no ideas on top of my head, but you shut me down, so you know what? I'm gonna shut up. Bro, bro. long as you ain't no lying shit. What you was gonna say though? Like this shit from the last time you said I should do, I can't remember what it was. But it was shit. um, I was gonna have you react to like to shit in movies. No, you told me to walk up on somebody and, yeah, she did. and ask a question. Yeah. You you see me some exactly. videos? You like, bro? You should do this. Why I want to do this? If you just showed me somebody else doing it. Because it I, works. But then I Googled it, and it's like a thousand other people doing it, too. Because it like, works. But no, that's the thing. A lot of them, they shouldn't really have no views because this how I'll be right. Once I see find like two, three people that do something, mm. that everybody else under them don't get no views. So why you start rapping? I, don't I know rap a few more, more rappers. I don't rap why are you a YouTuber? Yeah, it's easy. And I'm going to tell you something. What I, what, I, what, what I love about YouTube, you ain't got to invest that much money, bro. Like, once you buy your camera, mm -hmm. unless you run running ads on YouTube, you really ain't got to spend no money, bro. Mm -hmm. 
You ain't got to spend it. Come on. What do you think you can pay off more YouTube and TikTok? Uh, that's a that's a big question because you can get paid multiple ways, right? If we're talking about like getting paid from ads, uh, yeah, like I don't really know how much people get paid on TikTok. Clicks and ads. shit, like. Well, I say YouTube, but. YouTube, YouTube's the second largest search engine. I see. Right YouTube. under Google. So yeah. people are searching shit on YouTube. So yes, like, bro, you, I can make a video today and be like, hey, like, here's the top 10 cameras. And then I can put links into Amazon. And if someone she clicks on that brain. link and they buy anything, I get a percentage. Um, so I know it's YouTube. Yeah, I mean, I mean, it's my a company just hit me up about TikTok. They like, they like, I don't know what they said. I read the email and I closed it. You had to show me. But yeah, they ain't hit me up. But you got a TikTok yet? Yeah, or you got to make one. I'm going to make one today. Yeah, you got to make one. I'm trying to make one tomorrow, but I got to make a new email and all this. Yeah, you got to make one so when I drop the video, you can yeah. tag We're me. We're getting bro. the attention on TikTok and we're sending them to YouTube and then they stay in there. That's that's the play. Uh, but, mm-hmm. but yeah, let me see what else I got. We might be wrapping up here because we you know, it's been about 30 minutes. It'll be like an hour. We usually do like 30 minutes. All right, so bet check this out. The people hear you. They heard your story. They like you. Let them know. What do you want to do in the future, bro? What's what's your aspirations? What, where are you going towards? Even if it's not one hundred percent clear, where where are you going, and where can the people find you to follow along? Shit, my old page I had on Instagram that back in Suave thing. My um, but my new shit why fan Suave. But my rap name back in so I think, yeah. Back in Swabe. I'm, I'm, I'm about to change my Insta and all that too. Like all right. I just ain't changed. Okay. My other page got really all my shit on them. So you know, I gotta start all over. Like So can I find you on like Spotify as back in Suave? Do you already have some stuff out there? Uh, uh shit, I'm on YouTube. My shit on YouTube. Like, YouTube back in Suave. I, I got YouTube. one song on Spotify. Okay. Yeah, gotcha. I can, I can, I can sing some shit. But I'm about after this like interview, I'm finna just, I'm finna drop. Like, like after like just going from here. Bro, right. stay consistent. Bro, bro, bro. This is yeah. this gonna start the momentum. In 2018, yeah. when I was consistent, I made like 13 bands off of music, bro. And after that, I stopped being consistent. Mm. Cause, bro, once you consistent and you get hot and you cool off, it's hard to get back hot, bro. Mm-hmm. That shit yeah. hard. Yeah. Gotcha. Gotcha. Well, we're going to drop the links to everything you send me with the music and the social media in the description on the YouTube video. Uh, that's that's Trap Stories, man. That's it. You got anything you want to say? Make sure you say his number, bro. I will. Bro, I already got to say. Like a lot, of, a lot of shit that you don't know, like, he can teach you, bro. That's yeah. Great. Like, like I ain't gonna lie, bro. This the like, this the brains behind me, bro. Ah, uh, okay. I ain't gonna yeah. I gotta give you a props. Just look in the camera and say that so I can yeah. post it. Yeah. Hey, know the brains. Everybody know that. Bro. Hey, come on now. Thank come you. Come on, man. Thank you. Yeah, they know that. Yeah, they know that. <laughs> <laughs> they know that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, hey, that road that you gotta learn from somebody. Yeah. Bet. Yeah, yeah. Well, I had fun talking to you, man. Thank you for for sharing everything you did. Um. I know we're going to reach more people with this. I know you had a very intriguing story. And uh, hopefully this is going to be the launching pad for, for everything you got going on. And of course, we're going to talk about shit later on. So that's trap stories. You you got a trap quote for us because you ended up the... I did? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. What did you... I say? Oh, man. I forgot. I don't want to say not the same one. You can say anything. If it's a message they need to hear again, that's fine. Yeah, I got one for them. What? Give us... Yeah. Stay in position. It's a fact. Stay in man. position. Hey, don't let nobody get you up for Stay locked in, man. Stay locked in. Hey, hey trap stories. We gone. Trap stories. Hey, Nick. Crazy. I'm a real young legend, I one of the greatest Ain't happen overnight, it took lots of patience Been grinding for years, I did no waiting At this point I'm on stop, but they might well face They ain't gotta give me shit, I came in to take it I'm a six-figure nigga, little baby, I ain't basic Got a closet full of demons, I'm fighting with Satan When I'm out there, Waukesha, I move like the mage I been running up, baby, they been